Hello shooters, my name is James Dole and welcome to the American Trigger Sports Network TV show. We are here in San Luis Obispo, California, just inside Morro Bay and just under the shadow of the Hearst Castle for the 14th annual Southwest Regional i Revolver Championship at another very famous place in San Luis Obispo, the Hogue Ranch. Shooters, while we're here, we're going to be looking at some of the top revolver shooters from around the country. Some of the names we all hear and read about and you've seen on the show before. We're going to cover them all, we're going to see their skills, and I'm going to show you targets just as they strike. Shoot it ready. Stand by. Okay, shooters, I have the match director right here, Chris Chalet. Tell us what's going on today. Well, today we're having the uh, 14th Annual um, i Southwest Regional Revolver Championship. And uh, we've got uh, 117 shooters from three or four states from the whole Southwest region. And uh, it's kind of a really good match for warming up for the International Revolver Championship that'll be here on the Hogue Range again in June. So um, this is the uh, second or third year we've had it at this range, and it's, it's been a lot of fun. We, it keeps getting bigger. We've set a record again. We set the record two years ago with 94 shooters and set it again with 94, 95, 96 last year, and then this is over 100 this year. So it's, it's getting bigger, and we're really enjoying it. All right. Explain to me Southwest region. Well, the Southwest region, I believe, includes um, uh, New Mexico, Arizona, uh, Idaho, Washington, Oregon, and California. I think, I think that's about the, how big the okay, region is. Okay, that's much larger than I thought. Yeah. So these are not just California shooters. No, we've got uh, quite a few guys from Arizona are here, and uh, we have some shooters from Nevada, and we had uh, one shooter from Washington, but he had to pull out. But we, we would have had four states. And, so. All right, off the record, and nobody will know but you and I, who do, who do you think is going to win today? Oh, wow, I don't know. Um, Bagakis is always a favorite for limited. Uh, John Bagakis, he's from up in Livermore. Um, and then open, it's hard to say. Uh, Rich Wolf is really fast. Vic Pickett's here. He's got the you know experience of winning over and over again. So, um, you know, it's, it's hard to say in open. I think limited is a little easier to predict. Okay. All, right. Okay, All right, we got a little inside tip. Now we're going to track down those guys and see if we can speak to them. We'll be right back. Welcome back, shooters, to the American Trigger Sports TV show. Hey, I got Ron Jocelyn here. He is the man over at the Wheel Burners, a club that I'm very proud to be a part of. Ron, tell us what you're going to do here today. Uh, what we're shooting today is the Southwest i Regional. Uh, really a neat match. Uh, the neatest thing about this match is it's always original. Uh, Chris Salee, the match director, does an excellent job. Uh, the other neat thing is that this is a match that's growing year after year after year. We're 117 shooters, which was 17 more than we had last year. It's actually as big as the IRC it was five years ago. And the IRC is our International Revolver Championship, which is uh, our hugest match. And five years ago, it was 100 shooters. So this has really grown beyond uh, all of our dreams and thoughts. All right, great. Let's see, who else do we have here with us today? Hey, listen, here's another good wheel burner here. What's your best station so far? Uh, I don't know. I haven't shot, shot but three, so <laughs> we'll wait. Rich, tell us your last name again. Richards. Rich. And I originated this match originally. It started off, uh, what, about 12 years, 13 years ago as a California Invitational. Uh, the second year it was a California Championship, and then the regional started with Smith & Wesson sponsoring us, so we've, uh, it's grown, I think my first match was 36 shooters total, so right. this has been a hell of a growth, I'm glad to see it, 
really proud of what's going on in, in this match and i in general. Okay, we're going to see you in the winner's circle? Uh, D-Class, maybe. We'll are we going to see, are we going to see Ron in the winner's circle? Uh, D-Class, maybe. Okay. We'll have to see. All right, all right. All right. I, long, I, long ways to go. I, I see another bandit over here I need to talk to. Uh, hiding from me is what he's doing, but we're going to walk over here and get him anyway. Because he's, he's, he's a little long. Hey, here he is right here. Look here. Look, hey, look who doing? I've got. Look who I've got. Oh, no. uh, another wheel burner here. Tell us your name. Pete Lavacus. Yeah, Pete. And uh, what's your best station so far? Uh, golly, I guess the one we just shot, nearer and nearer. Yeah. Yeah. I had quite a few X's on it, so I felt okay, pretty good. Okay, yeah, and I got, I, I got to tell you that I've shot with Pete. I've learned a lot from Pete, actually. He's taught me a lot. I'm kind of new to the wheel burners, uh, so I look forward to meeting with him each time I go out there. He's a great shot. Uh, as a matter of fact, tell us what weapon you're using today. It's a 627, a stock 627. Um, the only thing I did was I put a titanium siller in it, and it smooths up the action so it goes quite a bit quicker. It does have a, a, a copy Randy Lee hammer on it, and I've got a, a ghost holster for it so it's a lot quicker. And a, a, a Seymour sight on it. Right, and because of match rules, he can't really take it out and show it to us. Otherwise, he'd be happy to do so. Well, good luck to you, and we hope to see you in the winter circle as well. We hope to see you back at our range again yeah, soon, James. Well, yeah, when, I, when I'm not filming, I'll be glad to come out and shoot with you. you can, I always learn a lot from you, pal. All right, thanks, buddy. I appreciate okay. it. All right, let's keep walking. Let's see who we can grab here. Here's a lively bunch up here, and, and I, I don't know any of them, actually. Hey, I know this is a wheel burner. Hi there. Hi, how are you? Good. And your name, Byron? Brian. Brian? Brockway. Brian Brockway? Yep. Who, are you, who are you talking to over here? Hi, I'm Frank. Frank Bray. Frank Bray? I'm Norma Andrade. Okay, are you shooting as well? No, I'm here as a cheerleader and therapist. Oh, okay. <laughs> Part of the support team? Yes. Okay, what's uh, been your best station so far, Brian? Um, stage number two, where we started with steel and paper, and I did pretty good on that. Okay. Yep. And yours? Um, so far, all three have been pretty bad. <laughs> all three have been pretty bad. Okay. <laughs> You, know? you gotta get closer to the support not, here. Yeah, I, I, I brought the therapist. I, I always start slow, you know. So hopefully the next ones will be a little bit better. Well, hey, the weather's good, huh? Perfect. Yeah, okay, the weather's good. We couldn't ask for anything better. It's a great day. Uh, actually, the targets look uh, actually very good. Actually, I think they did a good job here. What do you think? Yeah, they did. It's a good stage setup. Real challenging stage. Brian, how many times have you shot this? Uh, this is my second time shooting the regional. I usually shoot Bianchi Cup in Missouri each year, and then some of the guys taught me to come out and shoot this match, and I enjoy it a lot. It's a good people and a lot of support with the people, so it's fun. All right, well, hey, good luck to all of you, and uh, thank you, support, for coming out. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's see who else we can grab here. Uh, we've talked to Pete. Uh, we got a fellow sitting right here. He looks. He has a very, very serious look on his face, and I know he's a wheel burner. No, I'll sit down. I'm going to sit with you. All right, that's T good. Tell us your name, John. John Maxwell. Um, John, how many times have you shot this? About uh, my seventh time. Seventh time. Yep. Okay. What's your weapon of choice? I love the Model 627, but today I'm shooting an old Model 15. And you chose to do that because? It's the classic. We're kind of supporting, encouraging people to come out and shoot the old, uh, older revolvers where we started. Right. We're using speed loaders instead of moon clips, iron sights, basic gun. Okay, good. You having a lot of fun? Oh, I enjoy it. Okay. And how's your shooting going so far? What's your best station? Well, I don't know. They're just I'm enjoying all of them. I've gotten predominantly uh, A hits or X's, and I had, you know, that's what I'm trying to do. Are you a threat to some of these guys? No, I'm just an old guy. Just does the best I can. <laughs> Thank you, John. Good luck to you, pal. We'll be right back.
Welcome back, shooters. Are you ready? Sign that perfect score sheet there. Yeah, okay, perfect score sheet. All right. Tell us about what. Tell us your name again. Uh, my name is Rachel Crow. Okay, Rachel, and obviously you're shooting for Smith and Wesson. Yep, best and, team and, out there. Okay. <laughs> How long have you been shooting for Smith and Wesson? Uh, this has been my second year on the team. And you just signed a perfect score. Is that what I heard? Yes, straight A's. Okay. Well, I guess that means this has been your best station so far. This is my first completely clean stage. Yes. Okay. Good. What are you shooting today? Tell uh, us about your gun. I have a Smith & Wesson Performance Center 627-8 shot. Um, I got it two years ago. It was a prize that my dad won and gave it to me. I've been shooting it ever since. Oh, okay, okay. Great, great. Well, you're going to be here all day, and I know that we're going to see more of you. Okay, good. Good luck to you, Rachel. Okay. Thanks for talking to us. Okay, Rich Wolf, how, how are you? Guys? Good to see you. Good to see you too. Hey, so how's it going today? Oh, it's going fantastic. This is a great match, a great location, and we have some awesome, awesome weather here today. And a uh, fantastic match put together by the friends of Icor. Yeah, right. And uh, you're shooting as well. I, I see you must be, right? Uh, yeah, we're shooting today here. Uh, I'm shooting a Smith & Wesson 627 uh, in the open class, and we're having a lot of fun doing it. Oh, well, you're walking around with that clipboard, so I wasn't sure whether you are going to be the official today or the official that's armed today or actually shooting today. <laughs> uh, they, see, they only give me uh, authority in little doses. There. So they give me a clipboard, and then you take it away from me real quick. Uh, okay, Rich, where are you from? Uh, I'm from Escalon, California. Okay. Uh, let's see. So that gives you how long does it take you to get here? Uh, it takes me about four hours drive time. Okay, that's a good. But you have you wouldn't miss this match. Not this match. This match is the one of the highest attended uh, uh, Icor regionals uh, out of all the regionals, and so there's a lot of stiff competition here, and so absolutely, I'm going to try and run them down. Okay. How many times have you been to this match? Um, I believe this is about my sixth time. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to have the cameras on you. We're going to be watching you close. Okay, so do good for us, okay? Fantastic. Thank you much. All right. Thanks for talking to us, Rich. Bye-bye. Richard's standing next to our good friend, yeah. John McGackis. So, Richard, tell us a little bit. Where are you from? I'm from LaGrange. I probably travel as far, drive as far to this range as anybody. LaGrange is by Lake Don Pedro in California. Okay. Great match. Okay. Are you uh, shooting with John? Yeah, John and I have shot together for quite a few years. We have kind of a stage where we all kind of stick together, and it pays off show each other the, the tricks you see on the stage. It's real, it's real fun. Okay. John, John's a great shooter. Is John doing pretty good today? Yes, he's doing better than most of us. <laughs> <laughs> you going to walk away with this, John? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to just keep shooting and see what happens. How many times have you won this? Four so far. Four so, so far. Four in a row. Yeah, four in a row. Four in a row. Yeah, I think we missed you last year here, but we're making up for it this year. Good, good. Yeah, yeah it, looks like a, it looks like a good match. <laughs> All right, we're going to be watching you guys, and we're going to have the cameras on your targets, so no lying. <laughs> <All right. laughs> okay. Thank you. Thanks, Richard. See you again, John. Good to see you. Are you ready? Stand by. Range is clear.
Tell us your name, and uh, I know that you're the range master here, correct? Yep, my name's Dave Wilson, and I'm the range master here today. <laughs> well, Dave just stopped us a little while ago. It seems our helicopter might have got a little low, and, uh, well, why don't you tell us? Well, the helicopter was trying for some really nice video and ended up directly downrange and uh, a little bit low. So, kind of a distraction for the shooters, and we talked to them, and it, it's not going to happen again. Not going to be a problem. Well, we've actually talked to some of the shooters, and they have said something like that. And I said, the range master is reimbursing you for all of your shooting today if you have any complaints. Absolutely. And the checks say, <laughs> say uh, Trigger Sports right on the bottom of it. <laughs> so it'll be one of our checks, and he'll just endorse it. <laughs> well, we promise not to do that again, but I promise you, you will like the footage that we had there, and we hope we didn't upset too many of the shooters. Fantastic. Thank you very much for being here. All right. Thank you. Let's go up in the helicopter and take some aerial views of the range and give you an idea of what to expect. This is going to be a lot of fun. We'll be right back. Here we are with Colton Vosberg, and tell me what class you're in, Colton. Uh, classic. Classic? Yes. Okay, classic meaning uh, what gun are you shooting? Uh, Six-shot Colt revolver. Six-shot Colt revolver, and that's your gun of choice because? I just like it. It fits my hand well, and it's got a good trigger pull on it. Okay, how long have you been shooting? Uh, maybe three years about. Okay, competitively for three years or just three years total? Uh, maybe uh, several months competitively. I started with 4-H shooting programs and oh you did you started with 4-h oh no kidding yeah oh that's great i mean uh, i'm a big 4-h fan so i didn't know they had a shooting program okay where uh i'm down in san maria local range we go there so what, what's your best station here today uh i don't know exactly i think it was the one involving uh the six uh paper targets six paper targets and you did well on that one yeah okay you're here with your dad right yes is your father shooting as well uh, not today, but he does occasionally, yeah. Would you say your dad got you into this? Not really. I kind of started an interest, and he took me out, and that kind of evolved into this. Okay. What's, what's your next match? Uh, there's a take five. I think it's take five. It's a 22 match coming up next week, and I'm going to be shooting in that. Yeah, okay. So you you don't just do revolver. You don't just do Colt because that happens to be your favorite gun. So do you, you what, what are you using in the 22 match? Uh, Ruger Mark III. Oh, okay, Ruger, great gun. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. It looks like you may be coming out on top here. Yeah, I think I'm doing all right. Yeah. You think you're doing all right? Okay. <laughs> well, thanks, and, and we wish you the best. Thank you. And uh, we'll see you again. See you again. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Okay, that was Colt, and he's shooting in Classic. He's here with his dad, as he said. Uh, Colton is... Uh, uh, you know, you can tell by speaking to him, he's trying to remain focused on what he's doing, and that's good. And for a young man his age who's been shooting not very long, actually, he we're going to see a lot of him in the future. Hi, Molly. Molly Smith, right? Yes. Yeah. James Toll, how nice are you? Nice to meet you. I'm good. How you been doing? I've been doing pretty good. It's been a really fun match so far. This is my third stage. So, and looking good. Well, of the three then, what would you think would be your best one? Um, I'm not sure what's the name of it, but it's one with Bill Prone. Tell me what you're shooting today. Uh, this is a 627 with a weapon. It's a titanium cylinder. And you've got uh, quite a bit few reloads there in front. Oh yeah, ready. Yeah, nice yeah, one. very nice, very nice. Okay, well, good luck to you, Molly. Thank you very much. Okay, good luck. Have a good day. Bye. Okay, so 
Nose clear. Nose clear. Close your nose clear. Thanks for watching American Trigger Sports TV. See you again next week.